फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई वुड लाइक टू वेलकम यू ऑल इन माय फिफ्टींथ वीडियो क्लास ऑफ स्टैंडर्ड टेन फिजिक्स फॉर द चैप्टर इलेक्ट्रिसिटी इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो क्लास आई हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड अबाउट द फैक्टर्स ऑन विच द रेसिस्टेंस डिपेंड्स in in that video class i have already discussed about resistivity i am continuing uh, with the resistivity si unit of resistivity i have already discussed about now i am going to discuss the definition of resistivity in this video class let us see how we can define resistivity let's see the previous video in which we have discussed about the formula of resistivity what was the formula of resistivity resistivity equals r multiplied by a divided by l from here we can define resistivity how we can define resistivity we can take area of cross section a equals 1 meter square and length of the wire as 1 meter then resistivity is equal to what resistance this resistance so we can take the definition of resistivity by this suppose a equals 1 meter square l equals 1 meter put here a equals 1 meter square l equals 1 meter it becomes what this two becomes one so rho becomes r that's why here written as then rho equals r we can conclude these three things in a sentence how we can make a sentence let us see resistivity of a material is defined as the resistance resistivity of a material this rho can be defined as what resistance r is what resistance so that's why it is called uh, it written as resistance offered by a wire of cross sectional area a is what cross sectional area and which is equals to what 1 meter square that's why here it is written as cross sectional area 1 meter square and having length length equals what 1 meter so this is the definition of resistivity that is resistivity of a material can be defined as the resistance of a wire having cross sectional area 1 meter square and having length 1 meter by the uh, given uh, formula we can define it now uh, something more about resistivity certain material has different resistivity alloys conductor insulator so uh, what are the, uh, what are the values of what are the ranges of uh, resistivity of certain material let us see the ranges for metals and alloys the range of resistivity is of the order this is the order it may be more or less this is the tentative order which is equals 10 to the power minus 8 ohm meter to 10 to the power minus 6 ohm meter for the what resistivity of metals and alloys and for insulator resistivity is of the order 10 to the power 10 or 10 to the power 12 to 10 to the power 17 ohm meter you can see how much the high is the resistivity of insulator that is it is in the value of order of 10 to power 12 to 10 to power 17 however for metals and alloys resistivity is low so you can see here the values of resistivity and one more thing we must notice that whenever we are taking the consideration of resistivity of alloys then the resistivity of alloys must be uh, higher than that of the constituent metal through which the alloy are made up so uh, resistivity of alloy is higher than the constituent metals so here is resistivity of alloy rho is what resistivity of alloy is greater than resistivity of metal this property is used in this property that is resistivity of alloy is greater than resistivity of constituent metal property is used in heating electrical devices in the heating electrical devices the resistivities of the alloy have more than that of the constituent metal let us see alloys 
आर यूज एज इलेक्ट्रिकल हीटिंग डिवाइसेज मीन्स वॉट इलेक्ट्रिकल हीटिंग डिवाइसेज आर लाइक टोस्टर गीजर इलेक्ट्रिक आयरन देर आर सो मेनी एग्जाम्पल्स विच प्रोड्यूस हीटिंग इफेक्ट दोज आर कॉल्ड हीटिंग डिवाइसेज इन दोज हीटिंग डिवाइसेज द लॉयज आर यूज हैविंग हाई रेसिस्टिविटी वाई एलॉयज आर यूज एज इलेक्ट्रिकल हीटिंग डिवाइसेज द टू रीजन्स आर देयर One reason is what alloys do not oxidize readily. Oxidize means burn. Alloys do not oxidize readily. बहुत जल्दी से uh, alloys do not burn. They are not burn very easily because alloys have high resistivity and at higher temperature it will not burn. Therefore, the characteristic of alloys will remain the same. that's why and uh, this is the one reason for using it and other reason is what the resistivity of alloy is greater than that of the constituent metal so this that's reason it is used in uh, heating electrical devices one numerical which is based on resistivity let's see the numerical resistance of wire of length 1 meter 2 uh, meter sorry 2 meter and of uniform area of cross section 0.01 meter square is uh, found to be 2 ohm calculate resistivity of wire that is we have to calculate what rho we have given what length equals 2 meter that is l equals 2 meter and area of cross section is what 0.01 meter square that is a equals 0.01 meter square and 2 ohm is what resistance r equals 2 ohm we have to find rho and we know the formula r equals rho multiplied by l and divided by a so from here we can find out rho that is rho equals r multiplied by a divided by l so putting the value of r a and l we can get the resistivity r is already 2 a is 0.01 l is 2 2 is cancelled out then it remains what 0.01 so 0.01 ohm meter is the resistivity because ohm meter is the SI unit of resistivity and we have to find what resistivity that's why we must put the SI unit of resistivity in the last so this is the final answer and this is the resistivity so in this way you can solve some more numericals based on resistivity and get mastery over it thank you very much stay home stay safe